Two days before inauguration, when lawmakers will formally be voting on their next speaker, Mike Madigan has put his campaign on hold. That opens the door for a host of potential contenders to throw their hats in the ring and for there to be a new speaker for the first time in decades. House members gathering for the lame duck session at the Bank of Springfield Center got the news late this morning that Mike Madigan was suspending his campaign to hold on to the speaker's gavel. It's a stunning turn of events. Mike Madigan on the service would appear to be giving up and that's not Mike Madigan. It comes after an informal vote on Sunday where Madigan garnered the backing of 51 Democrats for speaker, but he needs 60. In a statement, Madigan said, this is not a withdrawal. I have suspended my campaign for speaker. The House Democratic Caucus can work to find someone other than me to get 60 votes for speaker. It has certainly led to a, a flurry of activity among my colleagues as folks try to figure out their next steps. Support for Madigan began to crumble after he was implicated but not charged in the ComEd bribery scandal. The company accused of providing money and no-show jobs to Madigan Associates to curry favor with the speaker for legislation. State Representatives Stephanie Kifowit and Ann Williams are already declared candidates to replace Madigan. Others who could emerge include Representatives Chris Welch and Will Davis. The Black Caucus met this afternoon to consider options. Other caucuses are expected to do the same. I hope that those that step up really understand the challenges before us and how difficult of a job being the Speaker of the House in Illinois is. The governor taking a watch and wait approach. I will work with whoever the members of the House of Representatives elect as their speaker. By not withdrawing, Madigan may believe no one else will be able to get the needed votes to replace him. He's changing strategy and hoping that he could become the consensus candidate down the road. Candidates are now scrambling to line up support, and there will be a series of behind-the-scenes votes between now and Wednesday when representatives will officially be sworn in and begin the public process of electing their next speaker. As one state representative told me, buckle up. Hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC7 Chicago YouTube channel.